Yellow Spinner, you're on Pens, the channel about pen spinning. My name is Alex Sukhov and this is Pen Spin Zone number 3. Today we'll reply a few questions and also we will look at the results of the previous battle from the previous video. Pen Spin Zone. All the questions which I will reply today were from Spinverse. Thank you for interesting questions. And the first one is uh, when was the first world tournament? Pen spinning tournaments weren't a thing before 20. Oh, 07. In 2004, UPSB was created, United Pen Spinning Board, as a forum for pen spinners from all over the world. They were united in one place and one forum. Three years later, they decided to make a first world tournament on pen spinning, and KPH was the first champion. Question number two. Is there an Indian pen spinner in any world tournament? Uh, maybe there were some Indian pen spinners in world tournament, but I don't know any of them. And I also never heard about any Indian pen spinning board or community. The third question. What's the proof for we can know that we've ordered our mod from penstock.net? You get an email from penstock.net an automatic email with the link to your order to find status of your order, items which you ordered and then stuff like that. And if you can't find this email, look for your spam folder. Guys, I also need to make a little announcement about the orders and delivery. It is a little delayed in tracking number due to COVID-19, of course. So you get tracking numbers with a delay of approximately two weeks. In return, I hope the delivery itself is going to be a little bit faster. I hope this whole, whole thing is going to end soon. The fourth question. What is your favorite trick? My favorite trick is always the one which I'm currently learning. But as a reply to this question, because I receive it pretty frequently, I will say that there is a trick which I consider to be one of the most useful and an outstanding in general pen spinning trick. It is extended thumb around and there are several reasons for that. First of all, this is how it looks. I have a tutorial for this trick and you can watch it and learn it for sure because it is extremely helpful. So what are the reasons for me to consider it an outstanding trick? First of all, it looks really nice. Second of all, Tornado, one of the most popular beginner tricks. Not, it is not a beginner trick, but it is most popular among beginners. Tornado is extended thumb around continuous. By the way, I have a tutorial for this trick as well. The third reason you can start, and it is actually, at least for me, was much easier to learn such tricks as high tour and multiple busts, with, starting with extended thumb around. The fourth reason, it is probably the most used trick in pen spinning. At least when it comes to using thumb in your own freestyles and combos. For example, you will more frequently use extended thumb around instead of normal thumb around. And when it comes to using thumb, in 70% I guess cases you will use extended thumb around. And the fifth, uh, the most interesting reason it is the easiest way to start a holy war in any pen spinning community it is always being confused with another pretty similar trick fake double and it is one of the best indicators of a noob they always insist that extended thumb around is a fake double and they always call these tricks wrong after Katrin93 and uh, some other YouTube and spinning teachers. And those are usually pretty militant noobs. Don't be like them. Watch my video about the difference between fake double and extended thumb around. Is it my favorite trick right now? No. But it has been for much longer time than any other trick. And now it is the time to see the results from the battles which were happening in the pen spin zone number 2. First battle was between Shaila Patel versus Steam GS80. So, to my mind, Steam GS80's combo was pretty much the same level as his opponent. It was longer, but it executed much less confident. As usual, guys, you can see that he can't do famous linkage without charge thumb flap. 
a common beginner mistake. As always, I will recommend you to watch my video tutorial about how to connect Neosonic with fingerless tambourine triggers nice. Also, I didn't like this overdone charge key one. It completely ruins the impression of the combo. Rather than that, I think this is a fine combo, about 2-3 stars, but I would vote for Shaila Patel probably if A. His combo was about 1-2 links longer, B. He used different angle. And also placing a camera in front of you usually doesn't look good. Ok, there were 109 voters and 78% were for Shaila Patel. My sincere congratulations to the winner of this battle, Shaila Patel. The second battle was between Calibus versus Assault Seeker. Well, I like both combos pretty much, don't have a lot of issues with both. Just a few remarks. Assault Seeker, camera angle is bad. Try to place it further, because it is a bit hard to watch when it is so close to your hand, and sometimes you go out of frame because of it. And also it is not very good to place the camera in straight angle, right above your hand. Calibos. Good angle, nice background, which allows us to see all his movements. Maybe too many fillers, maybe you will involve thumb more, for example, extended thumb around, why not? It will make your combo look diverse and more interesting. Also, pay attention on learning and using more around tricks, such as rounds, actually bags, new bags, etc. And today, guys, we have another battle between Assault Seeker and Stock Gap 9. Closely, choose wisely. All right now. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and push the bell notification button to not to miss the new videos if you liked such videos as uh, Pen Spin Zone, because this third video is crucial. I will consider about continue doing videos like that according to how it is going to perform. Also join our subreddit our Pen Spin, because all Pen Spinning the best Pen Spinning community is gathered there. You can show off your skills and ask questions and also take part in such battles as today. I wish you good luck with all that and the Pen Spinning. May the style be with you. Bye.